Jodha Bai Mahal also known as Jor Bai Mahal is the largest palace in Fatehpur Sikri commissioned by Mughal Emperor Akbar in 1569 for his favorite queen consort Maryam Uzzamani commonly known as Jodha Akbar This mahal is the largest complex of the Znana palace for women belonging to the royal household It is a masterpiece of the fusion of Hindu and Persian architecture made with red sandstone Born as a Rajput princess, Maryam Uzzamani was married to Akbar in the year 1562 as a result of a political alliance between Akbar and her father, Raja Bharmal. She gradually became his favorite wife and was the first wife of Akbar to honor the royal household with an heir. In the year 1569, she gave birth to her third and first surviving child of Akbar, Prince Salim. Akbar shifted his capital from Agra to Fatehpur Sikri in acknowledgement of his faith in the efficacy of the holy man's prayer Sheikh Salim Chisti whose blessings he sought for the birth of an heir to his empire The construction in Sikri started in 1569 and a grand palace was established for the empress and her newborn son Prince Salim This was the biggest residential palace in the city and to this day it stands though in ruins as a monument of Akbar's love for the Amber princess Jodha Bai Palace was commissioned by Akbar in her honor and was the largest residential palace in his harem It is also known as Rani Vaz and Zainani Deodhi It shows the Rajput influence and is built around a courtyard with special care being taken to ensure privacy This palace building consists of a rectangular block with a single magnificent gateway on the eastern side which was protected by guard rooms and has triangular ceilings and other apartments the eastern gateway of the palace is exceedingly magnificent and is of typical rajasthani architecture the khwab gah of this palace is a beautiful and spacious double story complex the palace comprises a hindu temple and a tulsi math used by his hindu wife for worship this palace was internally also connected to the palace of akbar Several Hindu motifs have been used in the building alongside Lord Krishna depictions on the walls which confirms that the occupant of the building was a Hindu lady. This palace has distinct Gujarati and Rajasthani architectural patterns. Many motifs can be found in the interior like swans, elephants, parrots, Srivastava marks, etc. The western swit in the palace which served as a temple contains Vedikas and other Hindu motifs. It contains beautiful curvilinear pillars with brackets. The superstructure of the building comprises chhatris, pillars with wall brackets, semicircular domes, and several niches. The palace is built with red sandstone making it seem captivating. Please like, comment, and subscribe our channel for more interesting videos.